And finally, new rule for 2024, America has to go back on its meds. <laughs> you know, over the holidays, I saw a lot of people, and I asked them all the same two questions. One, have you seen Woody Harrelson? He's my ride. <laughs> and two, if I said, let's make 2024 the year of blank, what would you say? I was surprised. They all said the same thing. Sanity. Let's make this the year of sanity. Everybody thinks we've gone bonkers. Should it have been difficult when presidents of elite colleges were asked if it's okay to call for the genocide of Jews, and they couldn't just say, fuck no. Can anybody just say, fuck no anymore? A terrorist organization in the Middle East that treats women like slaves invaded Israel last October and shot hundreds of young people at a music festival in the desert. And now America's streets are full of parades in support of the shooters, led by the exact kind of people who would be at a music festival in the desert. That's the literal standard for involuntary commitment, when you're a danger to yourself. I mean... The, the NRA are bad, but after a school shooting, they don't march against schools. Thank you, one guy. <laughs> the, <laughs> the far left's new crush is the Houthis. Up until a week ago, everyone on TikTok thought a Houthi was what you get when someone hits your elbow. Ow! <laughs> you gave me a Houthi. Damn. And the Houthi slogan is, God is great, death to the U.S., death to Israel, curse the Jews, and victory for Islam. Like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> so, naturally, when the college kids heard that slogan, they said, please stop, you had me at death to the U.S. <laughs> Insane. Insane that we're cheering for the terrorists now. It's also insane to think that this oh, would ever come out well. <laughs> right? <laughs> the battle for the soul of this country isn't right or left. It's normal versus crazy.